Ahem! Good now! The scenery of this morning is the same as it ever was. Full of despair and deceptively so. Hello, everybody. This is Chris Master Four. Welcome back to Let's Play Danganronpa Two. Goodbye, despair. Hi, <laughs> Mickey Mouse here. That's not Mickey Mouse. Oh, oh, oh Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> Mickey is talking to someone else as who's also Mickey. Yeah, evil Mickey. Okay, e evil Mickey. Evil Mickey. Anyway, <laughs> so Nagito has given us basically half a day. Six hour? No, you have half a day left. Well, no, now. But before you give us two days until noon, so that's two and a half days. So that's like fifty. Forty-eight plus twelve. Forty plus twelve. Yeah, so it's fifty-six. No. Fifty. It's 60. 60. 60. I can count. 48 plus 12 is 56. <laughs> you forgot four whole hours. Yeah, no, 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 it's fine. I mean, I'm sure he'd shorten the time if you wanted them to. Uh, yes, I can see the sunlight peeking through the window. I can hear the faint sound of waves crashing on the beach. But the bombs Nagito said are all going to destroy this. Once run time runs out at noon. At the very moment, there's nothing about a situation that's changing for the better. Usually, I'd go to the restaurant, but what should I do today? As long as I remember what Nagito said. Flashback, flashback, flashback! It sounds like he was planning to hang out at the restaurant all day. Wait a minute, he's gonna be there all day? Then if everyone went to the restaurant like they normally do, the bad feeling lingering in my chest grew with each beat of my frantic heart. I immediately ran out of my cottage. Here we go! Here we go! Level up! Here we go! Your pet didn't do anything, it just leveled up. Alright. Time to neglect my pet. That sounds like a horrible thing. Hey, Sonya. No, don't. 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 No. No. Um... Good morning, Hajime. Hi. Um, about yesterday, I may have been somewhat careless with my words. I could not keep myself from snapping at what Kazuichi said, and I acted on my own. Yeah, really. Kazuichi's not making the greatest decisions, especially if he wants if he wants Senpai to notice him. Yep. No, oh, she noticed, just not in the right way. <laughs> Thanks to my actions, everyone ended up going their own separate ways, right? Yeah, but what you said wasn't wrong either. Um, I have not given up yet. I will do my very best to live until the end. If not, I will be able to not be able to face Gundam, Nekomaru, or the others who have died. Specifically Gundam and Nekomaru. Yep. Interesting. Well, they gave themselves up to... They did, to but so did... Make sure everyone but knows. technically so did Teru Teru. He just missed. <laughs> I mean, he could have... Imagine if he had actually gotten Nagito instead of Byakuya. Oh, then the game How would much be this game would be different right now? Because I don't think Byakuya would have planted the fucking bombs! Well, not only that, but it would have stagnated. But what about the Monokuma bomb? That would have still gone off if that's, if that, if if that's a bomb. If it's actually a bomb. The moment I set foot inside the restaurant, the worst case scenario is unfolding before me. Oh. God damn it! Time's over! Now! Where'd you hide the bombs? That hurts, but I'll never tell. If you really want me to spit it out, you should try torturing me or something. Huh? Torture? Maybe you can stab my fingers with that fork over there. Or scoop my eyes out with that spoon. If um. you're not willing to fill me with despair, there's no way my hope will ever bro- oh. 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 Okay, this hand suddenly, suddenly wrapped around Nagito's They've neck. They've been there the whole time. And his face began turning a startling shade of red. Um. Going with me. Just die already. Um. No, Akane, please don't. Her clenched hands kept squeezing even tighter, as if she was trying to snap his neck instead of just trying to strangle him. Don't kill him. Hey, hey. What are you doing? Akane. This is bad. Hey, are you all right? Isn't he seriously gonna die? 
She was too overcome by rage to acknowledge us. Oh! Who slapped her? Is it Chiaki? <laughs> just walks in. Slap! Oh shit! Oh, she did. Shit. Calm down. Okay. She did slap her. Oh, I was, I was fucking right. I didn't know she actually did that. You wouldn't do something like that, right? You're not the kind of person who would hurt someone, right? See, it's all right. Yep, no problem. Damn. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> S sorry. I'm awake now. Good job, Chiaki. Slapping her back to reality. What? What's I doing anyway? Hey, hey. Th that's what I want to ask. Don't tell me you were actually thinking about killing him. And that's when it happened. In the corner of my eye, I saw him slowly stand up. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, Akane. I'm crazy now. Thank you, Akane. I got to see my dead dog again. I haven't seen him in ages. Oh, God. Huh? Serves you right. You probably pissed off Akane in the first place. Well. Mm, I didn't mean to do that, though. I don't know what voice this is. Anyway, thank you for just, saving me. Just, 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 just. I was like, I have you one! <laughs> You're getting so aggressive. You really are just turning into <laughs> Batman. <laughs> then, You're just crazy Markiplier now. I don't fucking know that. If you sincerely mean that, please tell us the password to enter the ancient ruin. Huh? The password? The ancient ruin? Joe, Joe. What are you gonna do with that? <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Joe. Joe. <laughs> Joe! <laughs> you Don't play dumb! You've hidden the bombs inside that ruin, right? You're right. Yup, I did. <laughs> Until yesterday. You moved them, didn't you? Huh? Did the traitor reveal themselves to you? You wanna fucking shut the fuck up? Hey Nagata, what do you mean by until yesterday? Well, there wasn't anything important inside the ancient ruin. Just some familiar scenery. Familiar scenery? Jeez. I got bored of it. Also, if I hid them in there, it would be completely meaningless. <sighs> See, if you had managed to learn the password to the ancient ruin, it has no meaning anymore. Now that I removed the bombs to somewhere else. Hey, hey. But they were inside that ancient ruin, right? I'm glad. Anyway, I guess it was right for me to move them. They were about to be found before the traitor confessed. No, it's not that matters. In fact, that might be better. Amazing. To make hope shine even brighter. Bastard! Stop talking crazy and tell us where you moved the bombs already. <laughs> Looks like you're in a hurry. Well, that's understandable. After all, time runs out today. Hey. Then let's begin the final battle. The final battle between the traitor and everyone else. The final battle between hope and despair! Man, yeah, now you're getting it. The place I hit the bombs this time is... A place you've all visited at least once. Hey, hey, hey! That's it? That's too broad! See? It shouldn't be that hard if you guys split up. For now, why don't you guys search everywhere as fast as you can? As long as everyone cooperates, it should be easy to find out where the bombs are. What the heck? This is exciting! It's going to be fine. I'm pretty sure everything will work out in the end. After all, there's no way Hope can lose. <laughs> Absolute Hope they can break. Wait. He's not. He's not. He's not crazy. Absolute Hope they can break through despair. Can never lose in a place like this. I. And not only that, I believe in you all. I believe in the time we spent together. <laughs> And even more than anything, I believe in my ultimate luck! So it's going to be fine. So long as you believe and hope with all your hearts, the past should be open. And with that, he walked away. Then he walked away! No! <laughs> and, and, next day. and yeah, and he left off with despair with a sinister mixed message. Damn it! D damn it, why does he still have to be alive? Dumbass. 
Now there's a time to complain about stuff like that. Oh. Besides, we don't have time to fight amongst ourselves. You are right. We must hurry and search for the bombs. We should still have time to stop them. I mean... But, based on all the places we've searched, I don't know where we should look. Probably the newest place. Shut the hell up! The only thing we can do is split up and cover as much ground as we can. There are exactly six of us. Each person should be in charge of searching an island. Damn it. And leave this island to me. I've already had the layout of this entire island in my head. Leave it to me! <laughs> Mini Mario can cover one. If I can handle the first island, then I'll do the second one. <laughs> Miss Sonya should get the smallest island. Are you okay with searching the central island? Huh? Wow! But, but anyway, you're probably not good at covering ground anyway. That right? It's fine. You can search the central island. Chiaki, you search the third island with the hospital. Hajime, you search the amusement park island, and I'll handle the final island. Let's do it. Let's hurry up and find those bombs so we can take care of Nagi to once and for all. Why are you stringing to Byakuya? Because her cheeks are puffed out. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Good job. We stormed out of the restaurant and immediately left to search for the bombs. She had she her cheeks were puffed up because of Hajime's hardness. So anyway, I'm going to take over the game now. Because Chris is gone. Forevermore. <laughs> so what do you want to talk about Har Hajime's hardness now? <laughs> Mm, yeah, it is ironic. <laughs> <sighs> Nagito is the reason we are all splitting up, but the reason we're all cooperating is because of Nagito, too. It's pretty damn ironic. Oh, we're here now. I'm in charge of searching the fourth island. I should search every nook and cranny. According to Nagito, the bombs have enough power to easily wipe up the entire island. And it's probably not very small. I'll definitely find it. Oh, is it the one in Monami's roof? Oh, God. <laughs> It mu it, we have never checked Monami's house, though. Are we allowed in Monami's house? It's open! Is that actually the bomb? <laughs> Dude, it's open now. The door's open? Looks like you can go inside, but... It's possible the bombs are hidden in here, too. Alright, let's go. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Wait, what? There's a whole rack of Monami's! There is. How should, I just, how should I describe this place? It's so coyingly cute that I feel like I'm gonna be sick. Are those all monitors on her bed? The heart-shaped monitors? Well, why is Hajime in my house? The door was wide open. What? As soon as I hear that, Monami waddled to the door and... Yeah, it's broken! My security system is broken! The robber probably did it. No, not a robber. A robber is no excuse. A female teacher with a young boy student in her house is just inappropriate. So leave! Yeah. I've been splattered with disgrace. Jeez, she's no. Are those all monitors on her bed, though, in the hearts? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's creepy. Well, it's because that's her way to check everything, just like Monokuma. Are these monitors? They're not displaying anything right now, but why are there so many? Are you monitoring us with these? <gasps> <laughs> that gasp. So I was right. Surveillance cameras all over the island and the footage those cameras are recording. You were watching all that footage on these monitors. You were monitoring us, weren't you? I was until Monokuma appeared. I no longer have my magic stick and because of that Monokuma stole all my powers. So I don't have the authority to monitor everyone anymore. These monitors are useless. What does that stick have to do with the surveillance cameras? Anyway, I can't monitor anyone and everyone anymore. I have no other way of following your movements unless I rely on these somewhat nifty ears. I don't really understand, but that, does that mean Monokuma has been watching us from these surveillance cameras? That's wrong! No, it's probably not him either. In his current state, he shouldn't even need to use those cameras. 
This power keeps increasing beyond my expectations. He surpassed any standard of measuring it. Hey, stop talking about stuff that doesn't make any sense. Who's watching the surveillance cameras then? It, the, probably, they probably only matter to the outside. The outside? You mean the group that's controlling you, Monokuma? Let's see, so the people outside the island are watching the footage captured by the surveillance cameras and... <laughs> well, let's just press aside that whole thing. There's no way I can do that! You, you big mouth bitch. Um... But I can't say... Hey. Is she trying to cover up by crying? That's exactly what Monokuma does. And Hiyoko. Just as I thought, I can't trust her at all. I'm curious, is she, does she have like a costume for every day? What does that say? I can't tell. What the heck is this? Monokuma plushies on hairs? This is Monami. Monokumi? <laughs> hey, don't, don't touch my things without permission, they're important! You, your own plushies? You must love yourself just like Monokuma. Wrong. You're wrong! Please don't compare me to that thing! You don't have enough delicacy. Entering a woman's house without her permission and touching her things makes your teacher very sad. But this will not be allowed. Hajime needs a class in morality. Delicacy and morality? I don't think those things have anything to do with each other. That's right. I shall give you a special private lesson after school. Miss Monomi will slowly and thoroughly give you a good teaching. Well, that sounds really appropriate. Yeah, it does. Now, oh, once again, I've been splattered with disgrace. Such a sticky and gooey <laughs> disgrace! Monami! You're the one who started saying Stop. it. Stop! Where's the bomb that's in her roof? I can't even read the no. sun on it. So anyway, you said something about a robber. Are you talking about Monokuma? Hmm. Monokuma wouldn't do something as cheap as breaking the lock. Ever since he took my power, he can do anything he wants on this island as long as he wills it. Power or will? You're always so melodramatic. But if it wasn't Monokuma, does that mean the robber is one of us? <laughs> I'm not doubting my students or anything, but my important thing was definitely stolen! What's your important thing anyway? <gasps> my treasure box! I don't think any of us would steal Monami's treasure What's box. What's I got inside of it? A fucking paperclip? But if someone did, why would they steal it in the first um... place? Can you let me know if you found my treasure? <laughs> it's a magnificent treasure box covered in sparkling pink lights. Well, if I come across it... <laughs> Alrighty, that's enough of your questions. Now it's my turn to question you. Me? Hey! Why did you suddenly come into the amusement park? It's strange that you're walking around alone. Something happened? Something did happen. Mm -hmm. Huh? That's right, I don't have time to waste at a place like this. Hey, I need to ask you an important question. Do you know where they are? Somewhere on Jabberwock Island, Nagito. Hey! Hey! Why, hello there, Monami! Wanna play? Oh god, Monokum was trying to fucking... Keep her out of the situation. Yeah. Wanna play with your big brother? Monokuma? <laughs> What's with your sudden invitation? You, you've never played before. He's gonna play the beatdown game. Come on, everyone's busy. You shouldn't interfere. So hurry up and go play with me! <laughs> ah, my ears. Please don't pull my ears. I'll leave the rest to you. I'll let you students handle the rest. Do your best. <laughs> Doesn't he know he'll die? He always interferes when we're discussing something important. I guess he really is monitoring us. No, now's not the time to complain. I should get back to searching for the bomb. Where's the bomb in her ceiling? I leapt out of Monami's house and returned to searching for the bombs. Damn it! I don't see the friggin' bombs anywhere. Walked in one place. Nothing good will come from rushing. I should try looking somewhere else. Yoink! Let's check the roller coaster and the castle. I mean, the cat. We we didn't find it in the castle. But he moved them, which means you could have moved them at any time yesterday after you left the castle. Hmm. It's looking suspicious here. Nope, nothing here. Yeah, I didn't get a prompt either. I don't think they're in a castle. Do you want to go back to the fun house? I mean... No? I think... It's possible the bombs are placed inside this train. So I don't see anything that looks like a bomb. 
Well, that was great. At least you know he didn't put him inside the funhouse. Mm. Mm. Hajime. I, I found them. You found them? Yeah, shit ton of bombs were piled up on top of each other. God damn it, I didn't expect to find actual bombs. Where'd you find them on the Sixth Island? You mean that stupid factory where the lifetime amount of Kuma plushies were made? A plushie factory? Got it! I'll go tell Kazuichi Nakane. Can you tell Sonya and Chiaki? Yeah, got it. We'll meet in the front of the bombs later. So Sonya is Central Island and Akane is First Island, right? Sonya and Chiaki. Chiaki's Third Island, right? Chiaki's in the Third Island and Sonya's in the Central Island. So you can sell Sonya first. I can sell Sonya first? You can tell Sonya first! I can't, I can't, I can't sell someone as royal as she is. But she's not a... You, Sonya she's... should be here. But the only place in this bond could be hidden is Jabberwock Park. In that case, maybe she's there? Monokuma Rock is another place they could be, you dumbass. But it's Jabberwocky Park. Jabberwock, not Jabberwocky! It's Jabberwocky Park. I know what I said. That's weird, I don't see her anywhere. Hey, Sonya! I'm right here! <laughs> Just kidding! It's only me. Did he mimic her voice, or Probably. was I just being dumb? No, no, no. I imagine her him mimicking her voice. Yes, indeed. Actually, may used to call Sonya, but nothing. God happens. damn it! Because she's already gone to a faraway place. Huh? <laughs> just kidding. If you're looking for Sonya, she was walking around near the military base. Why? The one on the final island. Didn't she already hear about the bombs? Even so, there's no reason for her for your, to be at the military base. Cause the bombs were found at the plushie factory. What the fuck? I really don't understand it, but I guess I'll go over to the third island. Okay. Why what the shit? She the Why did she go to the military base? Mm. Is she talking to people on the island? Well, maybe she was curious about that manual. That's the only thing the I can Manual think of. Samuel. Third island was the. Titty Typhoon Island, yes. right? Yes. Okay. Hospital Titty Typhoon. Chucky! By Titty Typhoon. There she is. As you keep running past her. Yeah, because it doesn't directly go to her. Chucky! I've been looking for you! Uh, what happened? <laughs> Don't respond so slowly! It's the bombs! We found the bombs! Hurry over to the plushie factory! Hey, are you listening? There's no time to space out. Yep. Ah, oh, you're right. The bombs are bad, right? You gotta go to the plushie factory. <laughs> what the fuck? I'll head over. At least be a little more nervous. Even in a situation like this, she moves at a snail's pace. Should hurry over to the final island and meet Sonya at the military base. So the real the real question here is, why the fuck was she like, they're bad, right? The yeah. bombs are bad, right? Okay? Okay. Bones are bad. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we're, we're the we're the Mackies. <laughs> Before I go to the plushie factory, I need to meet up with Sonya at the military base. You mean that place you just ran past? Yes. Why was why would an island like this uh, need an uh, army? Is the real question. I don't know. Well, there she is. Yeah, she's, she's pondering over something. There she is. Wait, what's she doing in a place like this? Well, I don't know, we should ask her. Russell! So Sonya's digging around the back of that truck. Hey, what are you doing? My! H Hajime! Please do not startle me! I am concerned. Phew! I thought my heart was going to explode! Explode? Hey, what are you doing here? Weren't you searching the Central Island? Um, I was, but there was something I needed to confirm here. Never m Never mind that for now. We found them. Um, what did you find? The bombs, obviously! They were found at the bomb- the- the- the, the bomb! Huh? The bombs at the factory? I don't know how you got that from what I said, but yes! <laughs> Let's hurry over to the plushie factory. The others should be there, too. Hey, what are you stalling for? If you don't hurry, it'll, it'll be too late. You are right. I understand. I shall make my way there shortly. Please go on without me. Why? I am sorry. It's going to be fine. I will catch up with you soon. 
got it, and I'll start heading over. I don't know what Sonya wants to do, but there's no time to argue. Unless Sonya for now decided to go to the plushie factory. Why is she even at the military base? I can just ask her later. Anyway, the bombs are the biggest priority, so I should head over to the plushie factory. Do you want to save this for the next episode? <laughs> do I? Do you is the real question. Well, I don't how, actually how, remember when the thing shit goes down. Huh? Where's Sonia? They told her about the bombs, but she wouldn't listen to me. She said she'd catch up with us later. Huh? Later? Why? She should know that now isn't the time for that, but... Well... Can I go bring her? I don't think she's gonna want to see you right now. Dumbass! Do you really think there's time for that, you fucking dumbass? You're right. We need to stop the bombs first. Alright, All right, let's go! We steal their nerves and charge into the factory. Kaboom. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? There they are. It's a car bomb. First thing I noticed was the roaring engine of a nearby truck. A truck? Why? You should click stuff. There's a truck parked in the middle of a factory. A lot of dangerous looking objects are loaded onto the bed of the truck. Hey, 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 those things on top of the bed! Is that... Damn it! I don't know how powerful they are if they have enough power to blow up the entire island, but... If there are that many, they must be extremely powerful. Did you really drive this truck to carry all these bombs? Damn it. Kazuichi, can't you disarm these bombs? You're good at that kind of stuff, right? Hmm. I thought I could, but... It looks like the engine is also acting as a detonator. Turn off the car. Oh, wait, no, that... Damn it, so that's... Why the engine's still running. The bombs are up, so when the engine stops running, the insulator will blow off and trigger the explosion. You? I don't care how it's built. Can you disarm it or not? You gotta, <sighs> it's impossible. I don't have enough time. The main detonator is put inside the bulky metal box and welded shut. The, there's no way I can disarm it if I can't get this thing open. So, it's gonna take you a long time? That's not good. I mean, it's almost... This is bad! Yeah, noon. What if we use the tools of the military base? Hey, hey, hey! We don't have time for that! That's my line, you piece of shit! The, truck is, the truck's engine is the detonator, right? Then can't we solve for time by adding gasoline? It's no use. The fuel cap has been melted on, too. I'm gonna do it! Then I'll just drive the truck into the sea! Oh, no. Bastard. You can't! You don't even have a driver's license! Oh, because that's gonna stop her from driving a fucking car. Uh -huh. Are you seriously gonna stop me? I thought your family was all about breaking the law. Damn it. But e even that's impossible. There's a chain wrapped around the wheel. If we can't disarm the bomb, stall for time, or move the truck, there's nothing we can do. Chucky, come on, think of your gamer knowledge. Come on. You hey, could hey. hey, check it out. Huh? See? There's some kind of machine on top of that metal box, Kazuichi you mentioned. Huh? The machine on top of the box. Hmm. Oh, this! It looks like a card reader. A card reader? Hmm. Maybe. We can disarm the bomb if we swipe the key card. Are you serious? What? Hmm. Wait, that might be possible. Nagato wouldn't be able to disarm these bombs if we didn't have some way of doing that, right? Huh? Maybe he never planned to disarm them from the start. Hmm. No, I don't think that's it. Nagito's probably trying to make us do something here. What do you mean something? Mm. Knowing Nagito, there's definitely some kind of theme for this to this too. I think. A theme. <laughs> that bastard probably wouldn't do something messed up like that. Right. Then we gotta find that. <laughs> Nagito's trying to make us do something here. If that's true, what's he trying to make us do this time? Um. You guys got like a few minutes till this thing goes off and you're gonna sit there and do nothing? Yes. We're gonna you sit here. To Chiaki. We're gonna sit here and do nothing until the next episode. That's how long we're gonna sit here and do nothing. You should talk this to is Chiaki. gonna be a long uh, few minutes until noon. You should talk to Chiaki. I think it's gonna be a long few minutes until noon. Like several hours? Yes. <laughs> well, no, no, no. 24 hours. That's still or 48, depending on whenever this video goes up. All right, we'll see you guys later for more Dang and Rapa 2. Goodbye. This right here.
Boys! Ow! 